With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So today we are going to discuss one more question on data handling. Here in this question, we are given a survey of 120 school students and this survey was done to find which activity the school students prefer to do the most in their free time. So from this data, we need to draw a bar graph to illustrate the above data taking a scale of one unit length is equal to five students. And now from this bar graph, we need to answer a question that which activity is preferred the most of the students other than playing. So here we go. So first we draw a graph here. This is our graph. Now in the question, we are also given the scale which we need to follow while drawing the graph. So we are given that one unit length should be equals to five students. So here we take one unit length is equals to five students. So this is five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. So this is our y-axis. Now we also draw the x-axis on which we take the preferred activity. So here we have five preferred activities playing, reading storybooks, watching TV, listening to music and painting. So first let us draw for the playing. So for playing there are 45 students. So here we draw 45 students are there who want to play in their free time. Now after playing there are 30 students who prefer to read storybooks in their free time. So here we have 30 students. So here we have 30 students. Then after reading books we have those students who like to watch TV. So there are 20 students who like to watch TV. So here we have those 20 students who prefer to watch TV in their free time. Then after this there are 10 students who prefer to listen to music in their free time. So here we have 10 students who prefer to listen to music in their free time. And after this finally we have 15 students who prefer to paint in their free time. So there are basically 15 students for painting. So there are 15 students for painting. So this bar graph is of playing. So this bar graph is of playing. The second bar graph is of reading storybooks. So this bar graph is of those students who read storybooks. Then we have the bar graph of those students who like to watch TV. So these are those students who like to watch television in their free time. Then we have those students who want to listen to music in their free time. So th these are those students who listen music in their free time. And at last we have those students who like to paint in their free time. So this bar graph is for those students who like to do painting in their free time. Now in the question we are also asked that which activity is preferred by most of the students other than playing. So from this bar graph we can see that other than playing the most liked activity is reading storybooks. That is this activity. 
so other than playing other than playing students like to read story books in their free time this we have concluded from this bar graph this is our solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today